video um, so we're going to listen to Dahlia's revised testimony once again I will try my best not to talk so much I'm not feeling too too well today um, I'm doing this video a little late so my enthusiasm isn't really sky high but I'm going to do the best I can so let's go ahead and listen to our new testimony Electrical pole. Cable broke on the first push. Remember that? Why, if you're telling the truth? All right, I already found a contradiction. So we want to go to. Okay, first of all, this is important. The electrical cable broke on the first shove. 255 is what the affidavit says is when that cable broke. Now, as far as time of death, that's a different time. And I, I've been waiting to present this evidence <laughs> You, I, with the court system in this, or, you know, the system in this game, you have to present evidence when the time calls. You can't just say, hey, there's a contradiction here. It has to be related to the testimony and to the statements. So, this is where you want to present crime scene photo two, showing the wrist watch at a little bit past three o'clock. That's when he died. 3:05 it looks like. So 2:50 between 2:55 and 3:05 there was 10 minutes, an interval of 10 minutes. And Phoenix apparently left the scene of the crime. So, what was she doing? Just standing there and watching him? I don't think so. So, let's present this. Objection! It's not the medicine that we are concerned with. Though how it got in his hand between that time I'm... Uh, let's just take one evidence piece at a time. Revised testimony this time.
Yeah, so our little life meter up there in the upper right hand corner will go down if we choose the wrong person, but you cannot choose the wrong person. There's only three people. There's Phoenix, Victim Dougie, and Dahlia. It's not Phoenix. brings up a an important point or um you know thought that maybe she planted that medicine in his hands too I still want to know how that got in his hands Yes, well, <laughs> love is blind, you know, he's in way over his head. If he ruins his case for us, I'm going to be so upset. It, you know, that would hurt me. I mean, it's like, really, I'm doing this for you. Oh, Mr. Grossberg is back. No time to read it right now. Oh. Huh. Mia's boyfriend? Who was that? Okay, I'm... S what does that have to do with this case? But, oh well, let's proceed. That kind of, you know, makes you wonder. <laughs> you know? It's like, it's kind of scary. Oh, okay, never mind. She's bringing on the tears, you guys. Uh. Her sweet Dougie, I thought Phoenix was your boyfriend. What the heck? You're putting it on him in court, so... And you're... I don't know. Sounds like you're lying, too. Well, she is. We have proof. Huh. Her motive. Well, that's a... That's a big pill to swallow. I would have no idea. Um, but... We're gonna find out in the next upcoming videos. I'm gonna end it right here, you guys. See you next time.